fentanyl takes so many lives. It's like a phantom that comes and steals your loved ones at night. And there's not much you could do when they're in their own destruction. Fentanyl has destroyed so many families and they're left picking up the pieces when their loved ones have passed from this drug that has kept them hostage. It's almost like they, they're the wardens and they hold the key and they just won't let your loved ones out of jail until it's too late. Friday night, I get a call. Said my brother died of fentanyl. I couldn't understand the words that was coming out of his mouth or even what he was talking about. I remember the times when me and my brother we used to sit for hours just to laugh and talk. But this drug, fentanyl, has taken so many families down to a different side of the world. And even though they try to get help, their loved ones, just like we try to get my brother, sometimes the people, places, and things play a part. And sometimes it just won't be things that you wish for. And even though the person might say they want to get help, you want to believe that person because you feel that the person has had enough. But sometimes the devil will come and steal what you got and you see that person it's not even the same person that you once knew you used to grow up in the same household clothes be raggedy they lost weight they're not even eating right and it's not the same person it's like they held captive that drug fitting on has taken over so many lives, so many family lives, and I'm left picking up the pieces. I hear my people crying out for their loved ones, but there's no, nothing that could be done when this fitting on drug keeps that person on the run. And even though they probably want to get help, they can't because they held captive and they have to suffer through whatever that drug do and it gets crazy sometimes because you always thought that whatever you do that person will make it back but sometimes it just doesn't work out like that I will always love my brother and wherever he's at, may he rest in peace. He will not have that phantom riding him ever again. Rest, my brother, rest.